the fantastic thing about working on the Life Project has been people like Grace who come into your life. Now, Grace saved up the pocket money and donated the money to Medicine Mondial. And that's uh, an incredible hero act for me. And it's hard to find heroes when you get to my age. You know, some of your heroes get diluted. My name's Grace, I'm 10 years old, and I live in San Junkin in New Zealand. So Grace, you've got a good life. You know, you, you go into swimming and you're doing all these things. Your life's got all sorts of things. Why did you suddenly decide to save up your money and donate the money to our LifeBot campaign? Um, well, I think I did that because I was, I didn't really need it and other people do need that and like I don't know what I was going to spend it on but that's going to a good cause, not just buying whatever, like toys or something, or lollies or yeah. How many lives could they save? How many kids could we save with these incubators? Well, it depends on how many incubators we get out there. Each incubator is quite capable of saving during its lifetime at least 500 children. So if we can get tens of thousands of them out there, then you're talking hundreds of thousands of kids. And if you get enough out there, we can save millions of kids' lives. For me, though, it's always about that one kid. Just if we can save one kid's life, he may go on to change the world. Just because you're born in a developing country doesn't mean that you don't have a chance of life. How can we help? Why should we donate? Well, this is always a tricky thing because there, I think there are two people in the world. There are people that um, enjoy life and go through life uh, and don't contribute anything to life. And then there are people that look after each other and have a perspective on making the world a better place. So for those of you that do think that you want to make the world a better place. You can donate money to Medicine Mondial and uh, for the Life Club campaign. Every $2,000 equates to at least 500 children to get the chance of life. And for me, that's a fantastic investment. And as Grace said, maybe you don't need some of that money and you can actually use that money to help people who are less fortunate than you.